Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey y'all, welcome to the video. In today's video, as you can tell by the thumbnail and title, it is our last day in Die Hard Roll Play. Uh, it's tough to say it and everything. We've been in here for about 40 episodes, 45 episodes, somewhere around there. I don't know the exact number. I know it's 40 something. And it's just. I'm gonna be honest and honest. We're leaving because the tuning in here has got kind of ridiculous. It's. Sort of a way people tune. They're, it's called meta tuning, like file tuning. They're changing the meta on their car just to get faster. And uh, it ain't for me and LJ and basically all my team. So today we are going to be moving out. We are going to be moving to a new city. We have all the trucks outside. I have went ahead and sold some things. So let me go ahead and get up. Uh, this shop right here is already being built in the new in the new shop we're going or the new city we're going to. So this shop's basically going to be the same. It's just all the vehicles, and we might buy some new things, get rid of some things, but let's walk out the door here, y'all. So, as we can tell here, looking pretty dry over here. A lot of trailers are missing. So, we know my brand new trailer I just got wrapped. I don't know if I ever made a video with it. It's gone, y'all. I went ahead and sold that. Over here, we have the 2018 Denali hookup behind the stacker. We got the 450 with the open trailer here. Uh, we went ahead and sold my monster truck, uh, my little, my little mud rig. I might end up buying me another one in the new city. Oh, I might build me a new one. Over there we have the uh, seven. That's okay. That's LJ73. I, I was like confused from it. We got LJ73 with the 53 foot in it behind it. Uh, in this trailer we have uh, Hazard's Nova, because uh, Hazard's gonna be going with us, and we just went ahead and put his Nova in there for him. He went ahead and left and took his two cars, uh, his street car and his G body with him, or his Monty. I think it was a Monty. Uh, in this tra we can fit three more cars in this trailer right here, y'all. We have Kodak in there right now. We got the smart car in there. We can still fit three cars in there because the trailer's pretty big. So let's go ahead and load up. Basically, we're keeping 36 foot. We're keeping the dump truck. The cat eye, I really haven't made my mind up. It, I'm going to bring it with me, but I might sell it when we get there. I'm not really sure. I love that truck. I don't know. Which one would I... Would you keep the cat out? Would you keep the... Like, oh, the round body. The round body? That is a good looking truck, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we might have to keep it. I don't know. Yeah, we haven't made our mind up. But we're going to go ahead and put three more cars inside the uh, stacker over there. So we're keeping the fair. We're keeping the. We're keeping gangster. We're keeping duct tape. We're keeping bad apple, Jack Sparrow, warrior, and a wagon. But I don't think this video is gonna see. I don't think the video is gonna see light. But I'll make sure to add the clips here in a second. That car right there and that car. They were both. That one was wrecked the first event out because of lag, and that one was wrecked because it got ruined too. But we both got. They're both back. I mean, they're different bodies and everything. It hates. I mean, uh, it sucks it happened. I really don't know. I don't know if that one should have counted. Cause I, when you pull the parachute, it takes you to a dead stop. So I don't know if we're going to count that one. But that one was definitely a wreck. So we got that one rebuilt already. I mean, it's, it's there. It's got a few more bars to get built. But we can do that in the new city. 
So, um, I would like Jack Sparrow to go in the trailer because I want to keep all my pro mod race cars inside of a trailer. Oh yeah, start her up. I'll run you over, boy. I will run you over. Mm. And LJ, if you have any vehicles you want to throw in the trailer, you can. No, I didn't get anything. Everything got shipped over last week. No, you just left Kodak here. <laughs> Kodak's in the trailer already for you. Forgot about it. <laughs> you forgot. You forgot about Kodak. Ain't no way. All right, yeah. Well, we got we got Jack Sparrow in there with Kodak. Cause you had it. You were messing with it. Yeah, we were gonna race it for the last event, y'all, but we had some issues, so we didn't make it. Um, this one's definitely. Oh, I need to get the front end off the shelf. You wanna come now out and get the front? No, you well, say that. I don't want. I don't want to leave the front end here. I mean, it's definitely coming right back off. But uh, can you help me get it down from there? I guess. so. Let me just use this nice step stool. Yeah, it, let me let me use it too. Oh. What? Oh, uh, oh. step step two has some issues. <laughs> All right, well let's go. I'll grab the other end. You grab that end. <laughs> Sit on there. Put this loose fasteners on there. There you go. Yeah, don't worry, y'all. The front end ain't staying on here. It's just got to be on here for shipping. Don't mind the sound, y'all. We have a. We have a motor in it right now. It's not the greatest. Alright, let's go ahead. Oh, will she fit in the trailer? Where you want Warrior at? I'll probably throw Warrior in the uh, bumper pool stacker. Yeah. Alright, so we got, we got duct tape with Bad Apple and uh, Kodak. Well, Bad Apple will be the next one. Well, I meant to say we got duct tape with Jack Sparrow and Kodak. Oh, and then the it. final car. What? I don't have access to the new wire. Oh yeah, that's the uh, R one. Right. You went ahead and put it in the trailer for me. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's on there. Pick, it's pick it. He's back. Mm -hmm. God, Lee. Ouch. <laughs> I don't put it in the trailer. Mm -hmm. Um, when we get to the new shop, we have to inspect the throttle. It's a little touchy. Oh okay. It's a little touch. It might have stuck a little bit. How bad did I mess up my stacker? I mean, there's a scratch there, but I can take some spray paint and fix that up. Oh, and my tail lights. Oh, oh and my tail. Oh yeah, they ain't gonna be happy when we cross state lines. <laughs> All right. So we got Warrior in that trailer. Um, what else? We'll go ahead and throw the fair mod in there because the wagon sits a little bit taller. So I'll throw her in the open trailer. Right there. Put her in the trailer there. Um, for this trailer right here, y'all, um, you want to go ahead and uh, attach the uh, cat eye in the uh, dump trailer or the dump truck. What? You wanna go ahead and attach the uh, cat eye and the Denali right there? Uh huh. I'll put um, I'll put the wagon on this one. So yep, yeah. it's tough. I know I can't. I'm not selling duct. I can't sell duct tape. I was, I thought about selling duct tape, y'all, but I can't sell duct tape. I can't do it. Duct tape's just an OG car. Yeah, but I, I ain't. The cars that are for sure staying, Bad Apple. And Jack Sparrow in duct tape. Side hustle will be back hopefully soon. She is getting closer and closer. Who hear that baby? Oh, I gotta go ride this thing for a minute. I'll be right back, I gotta take this thing for a spin. Forgot how nice this thing was that you drive. Uh uh. Whoa! Oh, uh, is it doing that thing? No. You have too many dualies. Too many long beds, I'm gonna rephrase this. Oh, it won't fit? No. <laughs> it won't fit? Nope. Not uh -uh. happen. I guess you gotta take it off and we'll have to throw the wagon on there. Alright, let's make it. As soon as it turns green, we're going, y'all. Oh. 
Okay, yep, we're, uh, we're not, uh, yeah, we're not gonna, we're gonna hit that button right there, y'all. <laughs> we're gonna hit that button right Jesus there. Jesus Christ. I found out when you enter the, uh, oh, if you don't have journey. I did not hit that. I found out if you hit, come in the area of the, uh, oh, who else type? Will she fit? Oh, uh oh. Kino. Maybe if I put it this way? Cause we can have the back hang off as much. Ooh. Yeah, it'll fit. Alright, the wagon's gonna go on there. Wagon's over here for you. <laughs> we'll put the we'll put the cat out on this thing right here, y'all. Let's not mind what was about to happen to the wagon. I got a little trigger happen. So we're we're gonna pay a few guys to move everything. I'm probably gonna drive the uh we're probably gonna drive the most precious rigs. So I'm What are you doing? Don't worry about it. <laughs> what are you doing? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Man, this is a clean setup right here, y'all. Look at this thing. Round body on cat eye option? I think I feel like it should be the other way around. Shouldn't you? Shouldn't the dually be hauling this single wheel? Sure. <laughs> but now nah, we don't get around here. Ooh, man, you're limited. Yeah, limited. It is looking clean. Limited edition. Why the uh? Why these wheels look a little curved? They don't. I don't know what you're on about. Oh yeah, you're on um, about why they look a little curved, Mister. They've never been curved. <laughs> They've never been curved, he says. Well, yeah. This is uh. Depressing day, but we'll be right back to the shop in the new city. <laughs> I'm getting the same one built, y'all. Uh, that shop has sold. I might end up buying the property again in the new, uh, new state. Just to have the land. I'm not sure. Uh, LJ's gonna drive. Alright, so let me ask this, LJ. Do you trust someone to drive your 450? Or do you trust somebody to haul the, uh... You drive your 7.3. Which one do you trust right. more? Someone's driving the 7.3. I'm driving my limited. You're driving your limited? All right. <laughs> so I'll, I'm going to take the 2018 with the uh, 53 stacker behind it because that has a lot of... There's a lot of money in that stacker, isn't there? Yeah. You got Co you got uh, Kodak Black. You got Jack Sparrow. You got Duct Tape. And you got Bad Apple. And a smart car. That's a lot of money in that thing, isn't there? Mm -hmm. There's like there's a million dollars in that side of that trailer right now, just in cars. Oh, you know all that struggling we did, mm. like all that struggling we did. There's an open trailer sitting over here, like just sitting here, like the gooseneck, you know, with the 450. All that struggling we did. Well, we'll go we'll go to the house and get the rest of everything else because I'm pretty sure Colt has a few things, but. The next clip will be us in the new city. We'll catch you in the new state lines. Hey y'all. So, we got moved in. We have not unloaded anything yet. We have got everything kind of delivered. Right now we're in the 18 Denali here. We are pulling up to the brand new shop, y'all. I know I said something about it was going to be the same shop as before. But, and then I found a good deal on this shop. So let me go ahead and show you the shop. We did also just buy this shirt, y'all. Dr. Sticky says, slick with the best or spin like the rest. <laughs> We're like a prep, baby. So when we walk in here, we got a nice little chassis table in here with a nice little chassis being built, a Proline engine. Hopefully we can get this removed because that is kind of blocking the lift right here. And some of y'all might recognize the shop from very old days. If I can find a video, I will link it right now. But probably not, because I'll forget. <laughs> um, got a nice little lift right here. And we got a back door. We got some toolboxes. Um, I got to get all the tools in still. And here's like the bathroom area. We don't get no tools. We, oh, we do get a toilet. That's about to say, we don't get a toilet. Uh, if we walk up here, y'all, this is where we can re uh, watch all of our races, keep all of our spare parts, hopefully on transmissions. 
fuel cells, oil pumps, dominators on days, egg gaskets, um, TV, we have to, TV script actually does work right here, and if we go ahead, we got some banners up, we'll go ahead and walk on down here, this is like the little office area, next little computer here, TV up there, a little light stand. But we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and load the cars because we gotta unload them. Uh, so Hazard's car, let's go ahead and uh, get Hazard's car is gonna be staying in the trailer because he has not, he has, blah, 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 blah. he's still on the way. So I don't wanna get his car out and make it in the way. I'd rather leave it in the trailer because he is looking for a shop. I don't know if he's gonna stay in my shop or what. Well, we got we got Kodak Black, we got Jack Sparrow, we got Bad Apple and duct tape all in this trailer and we did get the peterbilt back y'all so we should be good there go ahead and put kodak black in there so lj can come pick up because lj's been here for a about a day i actually left a day late I had to do some other things so and i drove i went ahead and picked up the uh, peterbilt and had someone to i had someone deliver the denali when i got here i think it was denali So we're gonna park this thing so it's not in the way. Park it right over here. She sounds good right there, y'all. Gonna run out. Next car we're gonna get is duct tape. The old duct tape. We do have gotta put the front end back on because it is off right now because you know how you know how it spawns. We'll go ahead and put the front clip back on because it was on whenever we left the shop. Man, she looks good, y'all. Look at her. Go ahead and pull this thing in here. Again, I want to thank, shout out to all my sponsors. We'll actually pull her on the lift because I got to do some fixing to her. Alright, next car we're going to get is going to be uh, a bad apple. No, it's Jack Sparrow. Jack Sparrow's next, that's right. Uh, I know some of these things ain't like that. Like they were when we loaded them up, but yeah, you know how that is. You know how that is. Gonna get the X barrel here. Sounding good, like ever. We're actually gonna pull her all the way around back. Oh, there is collisions there, apparently, y'all. Right there. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and repair it because we do not need a damn trunk clip from something stupid. There we go. Oh. Yeah, pull her in here. Can does she fit? Eh, she hit the lift. Oh, she is messing up the lift a little bit. There we go. She fits. It ain't the biggest shop, y'all, but you know me. I don't like the big shops. So let's go ahead and get Bad Apple out now. I do like this shop because it's got plenty of trail parking and everything. Oh, Bad Apple. She's all fixed and ready to race in the new city. We gotta do some testing now because we have some different ECUs up in here. We got the uh, Fairmont. We got the regular Fairmont inside the stacker there. And we also... We sold the 36-foot uh, bumper pool. The trailer we used for all the street racing. We sold that. That thing was gone. Yeah, there we go. Park right there. So let's go ahead before we move any more vehicles. Well, we'll get everything unloaded. So let's go ahead and get the Fairmont unloaded, y'all. And then we'll talk about everything because all the race cars stay the same. None of the race cars changed. I'm looking for a house in Grove Street right now, y'all. I'm hoping to buy it. He's asking a lot. So I'm hoping he lowers that price down a little bit. Go ahead and back the Fairmont over here. We'll get everything nice and organized. I want to get everything nice and parked on camera, y'all. And then we'll focus on all the organizing. We'll go ahead and get the wagon off, y'all. Gotta love it. Oh, 
She sounds good. Oh, let's pull her into the shop. We'll pull her. I don't want it to block base. Cause I like to put some other trucks in here if I can. I'm going to organize everything. So we'll park right here for now. And then we'll organize everything. Alright, also, we got everything mostly unloaded. So we'll go ahead and show you what we got. Ah! Ah, uh, well, yeah, we'll do it. So we're going to go. It'll be in the description also with everything I own in, with this. Right, we got the uh, we decided to keep those seven cat eye dually. Uh, with the behind it, we got the 53 foot uh, regular enclosed living quarters in the front, trailer in the back. Right now, we got Hatch's Nova in there, his brand new car, Outcast. Right here, we have our 2018 Denali 45. Oh, it ain't labeled, but it's a 4500. <laughs> she is a big dog. Right here, we have a brand new truck, 2022 GMC 2500, right? I don't know, it ain't labeled either, but it's a 2500. Yeah, she's on them stocks. Behind it, we got a uh, 2015 28 foot stacker. It is basically my little streetcar trailer, basically. Two lifts, easy to get around, looks good. Uh, right here, we got the box truck. This is not ours, we are renting this. We have a bunch of, bunch of things in the back. If we open it up, we'll show you all the things we got back there. If we get the open, there we go. Get it to open. We'll go ahead and run back here. We got a bunch of like tools and miscellaneous things, some motors. Yeah, she's full. Right here, y'all, we have my 05 round body 2500 Duramax. Behind it, we sold the other trailer, the other 20 foot trailer we had, and we decided to pick up this nice, brand new aluminum 20 foot tilt trailer. And yes, for y'all that are asking, it does tilt. Let me just go ahead and find where the uh, command would be at for it, and we will show you. Well, we might be getting in it. We'll get in it and show y'all the tilt command, y'all. And if we go ahead and do trim, see, she does tilt. Now you get your own personal ramp. Golly, she is shiny. I guess that's pretty good when you get aluminum. Uh, if we walk over here, y'all, we have my 2022 F450 King Ranch. Right, King Ranch. Well, it has platinum badges and a stock interior, but <laughs> it's a game ranch. I like the cloth seats a little bit better than the leather ones, let's be honest. Behind it, we have my 40... Oh, God. 40-something foot dovetail. On it, we have the 2018 Denali uh, dump truck here that we are going to be using for construction. Right, and behind it, we have our 90... Our, oh, Lord. A 98, correct? Let me check. Yeah, 98. Okay, I thought it was 98. 9873 with a flatbed on her. She is basically as cowboy as you get. And I know y'all didn't see this in the beginning of the video because it was at the shop. Well, we got our Peterbilt here. It is. Oh, God. I couldn't tell you what year it was. I have a Savage Stout on it. <laughs> we'll go with like a 22. Maybe. It'll be in the description, whatever year it is. Behind it, we have our uh, 53 foot stacker. Living course in the front, living course on uh, the Peterbilt here. Uh, this car, this thing can hold four cars. But we're going to go ahead and finish parking everything, get everything a spot, and we will catch you here in just a second when everything's nice and parked and got a spot. Alrighty, y'all. So, we got everything nice and organized. We have both stackers over here lined up across front. If I want to, I can still put a truck in here. If I'm like trying to sell like a truck, I can put it, park it here. Um, if we, uh, let's get everything outside. I still got the rental truck because I have not got a house and half my house stuff's in there. A lot of shop stuff's in there too. We got the round body, we got the Denali, we got the two Denali's right there. Uh, over here we have the 53 foot enclosed because like, there ain't really room for it. I'm hoping when I get the new house I can park it over there. Uh, the Peterbilt's under here because I like to keep it under something now since I have the ability to keep it under something. Uh, we got the 07 here. We got the 73 along the uh, 67 here with the aluminum trailer. We got the dump the little dump truck right here, which I'm hoping to go look at some, go to an auction and get, try and get some construction equipment. Cause I need to get some work going. And we just got like the little trailer over here. Now if we walk into the shop here, we got bad apple here. We got Jack Sparrow. We got duct tape. Duct tape's in the same spot because she needs to lift. And we got the two street cars over here. And y'all, she is looking good. I gotta say, I love seeing all my cars in here. 
people say these are a lot of cars. I actually look at it as it's not a lot of cars. It's just this is more of a track side car. This is my IRL car with the IRL. This is my first build. Well, it's my second build because Side House was my first, but this is my basically baby first build. This is my first street car I ever made, like street street car. Like, look, let's let's look at this. Stock, stock up there. We open this one. Look, it's a little cut. I won't lie, this one's cut out a little bit, but they both got the bench sheet and everything. She looks good. But with that being said, y'all, we're gonna go ahead and end today's video off. And uh, what can I say? Things happen, we leave servers, we go to another servers. But I'm gonna go ahead and tell you this server is them boys roleplay. Everything's in the description you need to know. Um, so basically, this is gonna be the new server. Like I told you in the beginning of the video, I had some problems with Die Hard. They were doing some file tuning. File tuning basically makes your car where you can't beat it. So if you've seen in my clip how my car ran, I file tuned that car right there. And it ran hot. You, it's really something that you got to fix. I mean, you can't race against file tuned cars just because they're file tuned. There ain't nothing you can do. But uh, we're going to go ahead and read you the server ad. Uh, reasons, reasons to join them boys roleplay as your new home. Uh, parsley ESX and, and V menu. We are parsley EXX and full V menu server, which means you can get the boundaries of which you uh, having V menu and everything. Our friendly staff uh, updates updates today. Like everything's up to date. Nothing's like out of date. Drag racing and asphalt racing. Is all you're gonna see. There won't be no dirt racing. So. We, pro we are primary drag racing and asphalt racing server for drag racing. It's small tire, big tire, and street class. Then for asphalt, we have two different super late, and one is custom only. We have uh, we are we are whitelisted server, um, 17 or older, and simply 10 minutes white of a interview to be in the server. If you're looking for a place to come and relax after work, do some role play, this is the place for you. Uh, Go ahead, uh, Discord's right here. Glad you took the time. Glad you took the time to listen to me today, and we will catch you in the next video. Later, y'all.